Hello, I wanted to talk about divorces or you know ending a relationship and today I have this beautiful client of mine, I love her and when she met her partner they were at both at the same place having problems with believing in their self-worth and you know they were perfect for each other for that time then they had two kids together but with time my client she started to grow more to do her inner work and to find out that she was worthy of love but her partner was stagnating and she tried and tried to get him to do work with her to save the marriage to bring it up but he decided that this is not what he wanted and so at some point out of love for herself but also for her kids she had no choice but to move on and she's telling me how you know it's almost a year now since they separated and how sometimes she just feels so sad and she's crying and i asked her you know what is it that she actually misses what are you missing from the relationship and she goes hmm. uh, that's a good question <laughs> and she couldn't find much of anything because he was not actually very nice to her. He was putting her down in front of the kids and things like that. And I asked her, I said, would you want your kids to have the same relationship you had with your husband? And she goes, no. And I said, so the longer you stay in a relationship that exemplifies the things that you don't want your kids to experience, the more your kids that become their imprint, that become the, the pattern, their understanding of what love is. So I said, so if you didn't want your kids to have the same type of relationship, you've certainly done the, the right thing. And now ask yourself, what is it you feel you're missing? And she goes, maybe just the dreams that I had that we were going to continue together forever. So sometimes what we're grieving, it's not actually the person, but the dream. And sometimes it's better to let go of the first dream that we had because with this person, because ultimately we still want that dream, but this person was not for you. Like in life, I find, remember, the aim of a relationship is not to make us happy or miserable. The aim of a relationship is to teach us how to love because when we love, we feel happy. And some of us, we're supposed to learn with one partner, some of us two partners, some of us three partners. So each time that you learning how to love, you get to a point where you will know whether or not it's time to leave. You've learned what you needed to learn. And it's okay to let go of the dream with that person because obviously it was not the right person anymore. And then a year or two from now, when you have found that person that really matches your heart, you're going to be so proud of having challenged yourself to get what you love, what your heart would love for you. That's it for now.